Human. Yeah. Give me your best meme. All right, my best <laughs> meme. <laughs> mm. <laughs> okay. My name. My name is T F W N O G F. I'm ready to begin my adventure. Or a tough one, no gif. Not sure which one of those is better. Uh, that feel when no GF is when I uh, what I would usually say. Just actually say the words. <laughs> yeah, but instead of girlfriend, GF. Yeah. Okay, so she has been an artist and the general's daughter, I think. Okay, so now we'll be the noble because that's the next yeah, one. Yeah, that's that because we just did farmer. Yeah. While living as a noble, you never lacked for anything blah, except blah, blah, for blah. a GF. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Magic, blah, 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 blah. It's your uncle's birthday next month. Your uncle is the Duke of... Oh, I remember this one. Yeah. Groblandia. So what are you gonna do? Um, I'm gonna hire some mercenaries to escort you. you know, it occurs to me that absolutely none of this really matters. Right. Since we don't even know, um... Yeah, gold. Mercenaries. Okay. Because, like, we don't even decide who we're gonna pursue until we've already done right. this, so... Whatever, it's just a part of the game, damn Yeah. <laughs> There's a new boy in town! Uh, the son of a noble. He sometimes shows up at high society gatherings. You've spoken with him a few times in the past, and he's really nice! You might even be in love, but you don't know how he feels about you! Tonight, there will be another party in the oh castle, and he'll probably come, too. What do you do to try and catch his attention? Being handsome and rich, he has lots of girls that are after him, so it won't be easy. Well, we're pretty and rich. Um, I'm gonna, uh, try to seduce him. You wear your best dress and spend extra time on your makeup. When you meet him, you use all of your charm to seduce him, and it seems to work. He asks you to be his dance partner for the whole night, and he looks eager to met you again soon. <laughs> You're right! <laughs> Your charisma and seduction greatly increase. You're riding on horseback in your private woods, but suddenly a group of thugs ambushes you and your escort. Oh my god. They kidnap you, they tell you that they are going to ask for a huge sum as a ransom from your parents. Ah. What are you going to do? Um, I'm going to use my charm. You are terrified, but somehow manage to keep your cool. You tell them that you've always wanted to escape the life of a noble and live an adventurous life as a thief, and you begin flirting with them. They begin to fight over you, and you manage to steal a horse and escape in the confusion. Nice. Later on, the thugs are arrested, but not before they can spread rumors about you. Now everyone is gossiping about you running away to become a thief. Your charisma, seduction, and social increase, but you've lost some faith and reputation. Whatever. Who cares? This is a boring, shitty concept. Totally. Great. Right. With creation. It's a troubled time. Whatever. Going to Triburg. I know. I know the deal by now. Yeah, This we ain't know. my first time around the this rodeo block. This ain't our first block. rodeo. <laughs> uh, th for once, we're not starting off with terrible health. Uh, yeah. Oh, right, because we haven't made dumb, terrible decisions. Yeah, okay, okay so. so what do we want to do? We... All right, who is left? 
This guy, this guy, her, her. That's um, it. Okay, uh, I'll do that demon boy we haven't done. Okay. He seems cute. So, the tailor shop. Go away. We're really not going to have a GF. <laughs> oh, yeah, We're going to perpetually know that feel with no GF. You're not even making a sad face. She's just like, I'm all right. I'm cool, but I don't really feel like doing it. I just want to stay home. I feel great. I want to stay home and hang out and play video games. Maybe? Yeah. Yeah. A strange-looking demon dressed as a cook enters the shop. Um, sir? I think you're in the wrong place. My name is Yuza, and I'm not wrong at all. Can you not? <laughs> Can you do a different one? Okay. Because <laughs> you don't let me okay. do mine that's that. Okay. So... But... I can see you're new here. Mr. Sartori loves my dishes, and he wants me to bring them to him personally. My restaurant is across the street. Oh, I see. The restaurant opposite here is the famous The Gold Sewer. Probably the best in the whole region. He's a demon boy. So, so probably you know play a joke. Yeah, you know how demons are. Yeah. Hmm, I think I've heard of that restaurant. Obviously. <laughs> it's that terrible one everyone hates. You must be a waiter there. What? Who the devil are you? <laughs> Think who the devil? <laughs> are you thinking you can get away with speaking to me like that? Well, my name is that feel when no GF, but I was joking. It wasn't funny. I have to go. Well, that was the wrong one. What a one. strange guy. What a... Clearly that was the wrong one. Behave hey. myself. It's an honor for me to meet you, Mr. Yuza. Don't exaggerate anything, but thanks. You are welcome. I'm that feel with no GF. I'm amazed you didn't know me already. I've only just arrived here in the city. I know who you are, but I've never seen you in person before. Ah, that makes sense. <laughs> that face is scary. <laughs> ah! See you, that feel with no GF. <laughs> Good morning, that feel with no GF. Oh, hi, Yuza. We exchange a few words, and then he enters the tailor's private office. After about an hour, he goes out again. From his face, he looks rather disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> Guess that meeting didn't go how he planned. Goodbye. Hang on, is everything okay? Are you, like, alright? And stuff? He stops on the threshold of the shop for an instant, and I can tell he's debating what to say. Everything's fine. <clears throat> Probably insists to know more, but maybe he'll overreact. I don't think so. What? I can see it on your face. What happened in there? He turns and approaches me, speaking quietly. <laughs> Mr. Satori didn't like today's menu. Oh, I understand, but that's not too serious, no? Are you joking? For me it is. I think you take your job too seriously. You'll see that tomorrow things will be better. The sun will come oh, out tomorrow. tomorrow. Bet your bottom dollar that tomorrow there'll be sun. He smiles at me and for a few seconds looks into my eyes happily, and a few seconds is kind of a long time when someone's just staring into your eyes and saying nothing. <laughs> of course it'll be better. I have to go I have to go back to work now. Thanks for saying that. Ciao, whatever. Cha, no big deal. No big. It's fine. He doesn't even look depressed. Yeah. What even is her morale? Probably average. It was average! I'm so depressed with my average morale. I see Yuza arrive with an enormous cake in that pot that looks like it's full of soup. 
Today is Sar Sartori. That's not even Sartori. Sar yeah, because I was gonna say Sartori. But it's not that. It's not that. Sartori's birthday. Oh, I didn't know that. I thought about giving him a surprise. Good idea. Do you want to come to the back office with me? Oh no, what if some customers arrive? Let's go. You can close the shop in an hour. Yeah. Sha. Sha. Oh, fuck you. Oh, it's okay. Probably. Okay. Um, who's this? Michelle. Yeah. yeah. All right. You've convinced me. Let's go. Come. I already have. I was waiting for it. <laughs> I'm sure it'll be a pleasure for him. My boss is rather surprised by the party, so much so that he almost starts crying. We spend some time celebrating and drinking with him. Before we realize it, three hours pass. Oh no! <laughs> it's very late. I have to return oh to no. my job. Oops, me too. <laughs> Let's go. We go out from the boss's office and Yuza turns to speak to me. Thanks for the company. <laughs> You're welcome. Between me and you and me, I can't stand Mr. Sartori at all. <laughs> then why do you still come here? <laughs> he stares at me in surprise. I don't think this ever occurred to him. That the music would just cut out. I know, that's like crazy. Well... Like crazy talk. Okay, I think that's three. Yeah. 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 Okay, so now we have to go and be a cook. Right. Which is creativity, which we're on the track for anyway. Yeah, and that's concentration. good. It's kind of interesting that like all of the roots revolve around you basically choosing your career around them. Yeah. Just because all the skills are work based and so are the encounters. And the only thing you do is work. So you end up just, like, following people to their careers, basically just because you want to marry them. Yeah. So that's neat. Yeah, just follow people into their careers because you want to marry them. That's what I'm doing currently. Yeah, same. This career. Yeah. Right now. never do that audience at home you shouldn't either oh yeah yeah don't choose your career because um because of things that you like and then if you do meet your true love there it'll be because you like the same things not because yeah. uh you followed them <laughs> to their job yeah and then burped in their face <laughs> that's what i'm going to do <laughs> just burp a big man someday you got blood on your face big disgrace Kicking your cat all over the place. We will. Wait, we've already done this. I we've know. Already done this I'm exact thing. I don't care. With these sound effects in this exact game. I know, but it wasn't the same route. <laughs> <laughs> so it's slightly different. It didn't happen in literally the same episode. Yeah. So it's basically a whole different joke. Yeah. No, 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 no. It's what um, we in the business call a running joke. Oh, yeah, oh, right, meme. like a callback. Yeah. yeah. Like a meme. Like a meme. <laughs> yeah, put it in terms you can understand. It's like a meme. Right, right, right. No! no! Yeah, from our new hit single, The Government Totally Sucks. <laughs> Sorry. Is it? What is that? What is that? Song? It's from. It's by Tenacious D. Oh, okay. It's like, the government totally sucks, you motherfucker. The government totally sucks. Yeah, I've never seen Tenacious D, so it makes sense that I wouldn't know that. Ben Franklin was a rebel indeed. <laughs> he liked to get naked while he smoked on the weed. He was a genius, but if he was here today, the government would fuck him up. It's what you say. Now let me tell you something. <laughs> 
not the government. Uh huh. They're fucking up the environment. Say what? They're taking all the fucking beautiful animals and making them fucking extinct. Oh no. <laughs> oh hey. More. Uh -huh. uh, next time on Heart Level. Maybe. Maybe that was that. It's something. It's definitely some. Next time on Heart Level. <laughs> Oh, that feel with no GF. <laughs> you should be at home in the kitchen. <laughs> oh my god, I forgot to wear clothes. Again? Again? Thank you. Thank you. Bless you. Thank you.